it's about time someone told y'all something, you know what I'm saying? A lot of these spiritual workers out here, you know what I'm saying, posting up, you know what I'm saying, showing off, you know, that they, they the baddest in town, you know what I'm saying? Listen, let me give y'all something. Down to earth. When I was uh, playing the streets, being a fool when I was younger, what I realized was it was an individual that said the least. The individual that didn't dress with his pants hanging off his ass or, you know what I'm saying, acting like, you know, walking with a tough swag whatsoever. That was the most dangerous individual out there on the streets. You know what I'm saying? It's the individual that doesn't say much that's really the person that's really about the activity that, you know what I'm saying, that he's known for. You know, an individual like that doesn't really say much. He just lives and people speak for him. There's a lot of people on social media, you know, they you know they pro, they they're promoting certain things, you know, they're promoting that they're they they're, they're the scariest person in town, you know, they they put up a lot of black candles and stuff like that, you know. Some even paint their face, you know what I'm saying? And you know, they they put this scary show on, you know what I'm saying? And you know, and and people believe in the hype, you know. They see the person sticking pins in the dolls and you know, you know, they, they, they get, you know, animals, you know, parts and, you know, they post it on social media, you know, they get blood and stuff like that. And they just do a lot of whole fuck, a fuck shit. You know, even in Haiti, you find that. You find a lot of, you know, people, you go to their pearly steel, they put a bunch of, you know, crazy faces on their pearly steel. And, you know, and, you know, and, and, they, and they promote that they're the dangerous person in town. But what you usually find when you get work from them and you get around them to get to know these people, you begin to you begin to realize how much of you know phonies and fakes they are. I guess in street terminology they call these people fuck niggas or fuck ass bitches. You know what I'm saying? And this is what you find. You know. So listen, man. Sometimes you gotta address things with common sense. You know, just like for you people out there that's you know playing the playing the streets. You understand that a lot of these people that actually profess that they actually are doing things, they're not. You got a lot of rappers that fall in this category. You know what I mean? You know, they, these rappers that are claiming, you know, they, 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 they're pushing, you know what I'm saying, weight, you know, from iPhones and stuff like that. When you deal with people that's really with the shits, you realize, man, that a lot of these people that's professing are a bunch of clowns. So with that said, I conclude this video.